Howdy friends, Brian Fleshing of Mad River Outfitters and the Midwest Fly Fishing Schools. And today I'm gonna teach you how to clean your fly line. First of all, this is very, very, very important. And it's amazing how many people come in the shop and you ask them how often they clean or lubricate or dress their lines and they look at you like you're crazy. They've never heard of such a thing. And I'm telling you friends, it will make a huge difference in how the line behaves how it shoots through the guides, how it floats, how it lifts off the water, but most of all, how long it lasts. Um, and one other thing that you need to do on a fairly regular basis is you should go through and you should stretch your fly line fairly regularly. Just go through and take little two to three foot sections and stretch it like this. Every once in a while, I'll take the entire, I usually stretch the just the weight forward part or the part that I'm using most often. But every once in a while, once or twice a year, I'll go out in the street in the neighborhood and take out all 80 foot. Christina will grab one end, I'll grab the other, and we'll stretch that whole line. And of course the neighbors think I'm crazy. Um, but it really does make a big difference on how the line behaves. But then as far as cleaning goes, just get yourself a scientific anglers fly line dressing kit okay and it, it it comes with the fly line dressing and lubricant itself and then it comes with this handy little cleaning pad and on the cleaning pad the one side of the pad is like sandpaper very fine grit sandpaper and then the other side of the pad is the spongy side Okay, and what you're going to do first is you're going to take the sandpaper side and you're simply going to, I squeeze pretty hard, just make sure you don't burn your fingers off. You want to keep your fingerprints. And you're going to just run that through, maybe do it a couple of times, but you're going to notice, look here already, you can see up close the grit and the grime that I just scraped off this line. It's actually pretty gross. If you fish in really like scummy ponds or places where there's a, just a bunch of algae and stuff, this is so very, very important. And then I'll bring it through again. And again, you're gonna see that black line on there of the dirt and grime that I just scraped off the fly line, okay? Uh, just a side note, I go through a lot more of these pads than I do of the dressing. And so thank you, Scientific Anglers. They uh, are now offering just the pads alone. When I'm guiding, when I'm fishing, when I'm teaching, I've always got a couple of these pads in my pocket. Uh, and, and that way I can just reach right up and give it a good once over and get some of that grit and grime off. And now you're gonna flip it over to the spongy side and I'll go kind of on one side, okay? And I'll just put a dollop of the solution there. And now I'm just gonna run it through pretty liberally. You don't necessarily have to squeeze too hard. And then I'm gonna come over to a more dry side of the pad and kind of buff it off, so to speak. And that's really all there is to it. You're going to notice a big difference. Ooh. That's, that's like butter, if I don't say so myself. You're going to notice a huge difference on how this line behaves. Trust me, I know that tons of you are going to chime in and say that you never heard of this and that you, you got one of these from matteroutfitters.com. You tried it and made a huge difference. But I'm also telling you, it makes a big difference on how long this line will last you. If you take care of it and you clean and lubricate your line, that fly line should last two to three times as long, no question. And then the life of it, it's going to be much happier. And so are you as an angler. So there you have it, friends. Clean your fly lines, clean and lubricate them often. Scientific Angler's fly line dressing and the cleaning pads, of course, available at matteroutfitters.com. There you have it. Quick tip for the day. Thanks as always for tuning in. Be sure to subscribe and stay tuned because we have a lot more useless, uh, excuse me, useful information coming your way. If you like this video, hit subscribe. It helps out a lot. 
and check out these oh, videos. So nice. You think you might like them too. It's like a, it's like a baby's bottle. So smooth. Oh, I just love it. <laughs>